monster, guys. Yes, yes, it's five pounders. So. I really just put the camera down, everybody. He just got. Oh, look at that. <laughs> uh oh. Fishing. Oh, 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 look at the one behind him. It's Jack's. Big Jack's on him. There's Jack's all over him. Try to get it. I got a dog. I got a Jack and a man. I got two. Oh, he came off. He did. He did. As you see, the Jack took it away from him. Welcome to the Chew On This Saltwater Fishing Show. Fishing television with intensity. Yeah! Well, hello, everybody out there at YouTube World. I'm Captain Ben Chancy, and welcome to this episode of you on this and this is a bass fishing show and real quick like I want to show you guys something I thought was pretty cool um, night cat got in touch with me and they said hey we got this awesome folding stool and I think it would work really well maybe on the boat maybe camping maybe in your house for your wife to step on to hang pictures or whatever or you you know and I said hey that's a pretty cool thing I go send me a couple so I can show them to my fans on the show and uh, sure enough they sent them to me I just got them yesterday and this is what it looks like. You know what, it is pretty cool. So what you do is you see these finger holes in it, you put your finger holes in right there, and you just open it up like an accordion, right? So you open it up like an accordion and then you twist it. When you twist it, it makes it so it locks in. So you can be at this height, and I know people are gonna ask, well, is it just that height or can you make it different heights? Well, you sure can. So what you do is you put your fingers back into the hole, you pull it back apart, you twist it again, and you can stop it at whatever height you want. Just like that. I'm sitting on one of them right now. This is what it looks like. And then if you look behind me, there's the packaging. And you know what? Here's the deal I made with them for you, my fans at home. So if you comment, like the show, you know, do all that cool stuff, ring the bell, subscribe, share it, and all those cool things. What they are gonna do is they're gonna pick one of the persons that comments below and they are gonna send them one of these. Free of charge to you, you can be the winner. If you don't want it as a prize, make sure you check them out. The description is gonna be below and you will have a you have an opportunity to purchase one of these very cool stools. It's really neat. You know, I've never seen it. I thought it looked cool, but I didn't know exactly what I was getting. And now that I've got it in my hands, I think it's a pretty cool product. So once again, if you want to purchase one, there's a description below. You can click on the link and you can purchase one. But if you're one of the lucky commenters, the lucky commenter that they choose, then you get to win one of these. The Night Cat holding stool. I think it's a cool stool. <laughs> Man, the lighting is so much better on this. Oh, is it? it even makes you look good, John. Right, we are out here and this is our first day of filming with the uh, iPhone 11 Pro Max whatever whatever deal right now and uh, if I look around it seems like we're getting some great color out of it and uh, if we catch some fish you guys will have a pretty cool video and if you don't I'm Captain Ben Chancy and Captain John Black took me fishing and we didn't catch anything <laughs> <laughs> that guy right there no no usually he always puts this on him though we'll try so here we go. We're gonna start fishing. We get some good. We'll show it to you. All right, everybody. We're going underneath this uh, tunnel here. Captain John says sometimes there's some big blow-ups down the middle of it, but he also says there's some big old spiders that come in off of it. That part kind of freaks me out a little bit. If you look up there, look at all them spider webs and all those little cocoon looking things. Ooh, everywhere. All right, we just saw a bass right there and a garfish. He's right at the base of that. Mm. John pulled away from the gar because he didn't want the gar to get it, but actually there was a bass behind it and we missed it. But it's in there. It looked at it. So that gives us hope. Maybe we'll catch something. We're top water fishing today. If it gets pretty consistent, maybe we can get one on film actually biting. That would be awesome. All right, everybody. In case you don't remember, 
our contest is going on for you to have the opportunity to win the fishing trip of a lifetime. It's still going on right now. It all goes about, you increase your chances every time you share and chill on this fishing video, every time you comment, every time you, uh, every time you ring the notification. I know you can only do that once, but if you subscribe, you ring the notification. All those cool things, you share it across multiple media platforms. Your chances of winning the Chew on This fishing trip of a lifetime for this summer increase. So be sure to do all those cool things. And remember, the contest goes through May the 31st. And this summer, we will be filming a show with the winner of the Chew on This fishing trip of a lifetime out of Stewart, Florida. So help me out. We need as many, 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 many likes, subs, and all that stuff. So we can play with this YouTube algorithm and they can show us much love. Hope you guys have enjoyed everything you've been seeing at Chew on this. And like I said, we need as much help as we can get from you. Thanks a lot for watching all these shows and enjoy this bass fishing episode. They're everywhere. All right, we, we found some kind of creature down there. Uh, I think it might be tilapia maybe. Oh, there's some bigger fish back in the back. Yeah, yeah, you can't be passing that up. John's giving up on his top water underneath there. I don't think that's the best spot for it. Oh, some wacky style worm in it. Yeah, he threw it right next to a fish. Oh, a garfish looking. Went right by it. I see. Oh, there, there it goes. There they go, right there. See them swimming by right now. What you guys at home think that is? I don't know what it is. Give it your best guess. If we don't catch it, we ain't gonna know what it is. But give it your best guess, because maybe, 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 maybe. Top water now, worm. What do you think we should try? Captain John needs help sometimes. <laughs> that dock was loaded with fish. We should at least catch one. There's some like four or five pounder plus fish under there. We'll try that one on the way out. Oh, Captain John just got hit. Oh, look at that. Oh. <laughs> Boy, that was a nice fish too. Oh. Well, we had it on for a moment. One eight though. You know, the reason why we're wondering about them eating is because we're day after a cold front. Day after cold front's not always the greatest. So, um, Captain John fish yesterday caught no bass but he did catch a snook and a big jack he thought he had a world record bass on but it ended up being a jack how big was your jack <laughs> he thought it was a world record bass <laughs> me. yes we are freshwater fishing we are freshwater fishing but our saltwater fish especially our brackish water fish they have a tendency to sneak in and that's what's going on Sneaking in. You got one, John? Yep. Got a monster. I got one. We'll take it. There he is, guys. Top water fishing. Oh, yeah. Uh, a little fatty. Hey. hey. Yeah, buddy. Oh, he feels a little chilly, guys. Cold front, cold water bass fish. Take what you can get. Yeah, we want a little bigger, but... There you go. Put him back. We are on the board. That's a lot better than not being on the board. Let's see if we can get a bigger one. We're gonna try. Alright, Captain John just had a big blow up and missed it. We're hoping that he comes back. Sometimes they act good for TV, other times they go, nope, you missed your opportunity. Let's see if we got actors. It looked like a snook blow up. 
We need to get this one. Especially since we hadn't caught him yet. He just made another cast, I'm hoping. While I'm looking at you guys. And my girls out there. A lot of girls been fishing with us this past week. Hopefully it eats. It should eat. It's not eating. We'll be back in a minute. Sorry, Joker. We got us another one. Oh, that one is oh, a fish. Oh, yeah, 100. one with it. There was another one with it. Oh, I told him I thought it was a garfish. I got a, uh, I'm like, oh, a garfish. But it's a bass. That's a good one. Yep. Oh, he wanted there. He got us. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah. I'm kind of fat right there. I'm like him. We'll take him. He's chubby. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Little thick chubber there. John, you like chubby girls, don't you? Yeah, I like them. <laughs> so what's up? How'd you catch that one? Well, he was using the old famous chug bug, guys. Check it out, check it out. Well, I can't hold the rod. I'm all done. All right. Look we'll at this. You. Look, there's no paint on it. Nothing. Probably caught a couple hundred fish on this. I changed the hooks, though. Made by Storm Lures. You do a little walking action with it. Nice. Yeah, you fatty. Here, hold it up again. I'll take your picture. It's a monster, guys. Yes, yes, it's five pounder or so. Oh, stay there. I really just put the camera down, everybody. He just got, oh, look at that. <laughs> Uh-oh. That's close enough, right? Right, that's close enough. We're not fishing a tournament. Or is it not close enough because he didn't get to put his thumb in his mouth and, and take a picture? Does he get credit? Let us know. Do you think he gets credit for that one? I mean, you got to see it on video. Does he get credit or not? Let us know. She get credit, Captain John. Uh, I want credit. <laughs> <laughs> I really just put the camera down. And as soon as I went to go cast, he had already got another one. So we haven't even moved the boat. Which is pretty cool. Action too. Come on, come on, come on. Somebody let Cat and Bill catch one. <laughs> there it is, right? Oh, he's barely got it hooked. Oh, look at that. Oh, come in the gizzard. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you? Yeah, boy. I need some sharp hooks too. Okay, here we go. Up right after John has got jacks and bass and everything else. I slipped on in with a little bit of action when he put his rod down. Here we go, baby. <laughs> Here we go. Come on. What you got, John? It's a good fish, but... Oh, he got a good fish, but it's at him on the piling. God dang. I just lost a good one. He's still on, guys. He's on there. Oh, he's fighting him. He right don't want to lose... Particles. He don't want to lose his last... Uh, <laughs> his I'm last... Out. Oh, he's out. He's out. Look, look. He's over here. He's got a fight. Oh, he's going to crash it. There he is. Oh, oh, that great jump, and he was blocked by the pole. <laughs> <laughs> There's another. Oh, the line is so chewed up, guys. Oh, lucky. Lucky. Yeah. You got to see how chewed up this line is. Look at that line. <laughs> He's all around. Look at that. It's all yeah. beat up. <laughs> we opened the bell, though. We opened the bell. That's a little saltwater trick there, huh? Or he'd have broke you off on the pilot. He would have huh? broke me off. Ah, another two and a half, three pounder. Nice. Good stuff. Nice. How much you weigh? He's probably two and a half. Nice. Yep. It's not, I don't, he's not three yet. He's getting there. All right, we're going to put him in the live well. At the end of the day, we'll see what we got. Just like we fish in the tournament. Throw him in here right here. There we go. Yeah. Got me another one, guys. They're all about the same size right now. Good fish. All about the same size. We need a big one. We're going to get one tonight. Captain Ben's going to catch that 10-pounder tonight. Oh, yeah. 
we just playing, having fun. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Uh, we're having a good time. Hope you're enjoying it as well. Uh -oh. oh, we got another one. No, it's going to come up. Oh, yeah. Oh. Hey, guys, we getting into him. Now, now, he ate this one, guys. Watch this. He ate this. I'm going to try to get We finally got a hungry one. Um, yeah, don't do that in the tournament. Now, that's what you call eating it. He wanted it. There you go. That's eating it right there. Oh, yeah. It's getting fired up out here. Oh, oh, look at the one behind him. It's Jack's. Big Jack's on him. There's Jack's all over him trying to get him. I got a double. I got a Jack and a bear. I got two. Oh, he came off. He did. He did. Did you see it? A Jack took it away from him. I'm sorry about that uh, filming you guys because uh, I was going to try to make a cast. Dude, the guys... Jack had it for a while. Did you see that? I was like, I'm going to lose both of them. That is awesome. Oh. That's a stud. Oh, yeah. Dude, a big old Jack came up and tried. I had him on one on each one. He tried to take away from the bass. Oh, look where you hit it. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, that man. That's awesome. That's some damage from them big Jacks right there. I seen him come up trying to bite the bass. I was like, wow. These are war zone out here, guys. <laughs> when you got saltwater species, they can eat. I'll try to wash it off. That right there is what the jacks did to him. I don't know if this guy's gonna survive or not. We're gonna put him in here with some oxygen and hopefully he'll be all right. Let's see what happens. Oh, he's knocking. Can you believe we got a bass and a jack on at the same time? That guy up there, boy, bass fishing extraordinaire. And now that he's a saltwater guy for the last seven, eight years, he's like, I catch them both in the same spot. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my God. Oh, Cap John's got another one. I want this one to stay on, please. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Stay on, baby. <laughs> this is the one we're looking for. He's got one hook, guys. One hook. Oh, yeah, he's a big one. He's got one hook. One hook. <laughs> he's big. In a turtle, you'd be there like, no. Bring that boy up here. Ah, yeah! Ah, nice. Yeah. Woo That's what I'm saying right mm -hmm. there. He's still got one little hook in it. Woo! That's what I'm talking about, guys. That's what the... Oh, yeah! He's a big fatty right there. Hey, got him sideways. <laughs> John said that's a big fish. Yeah, it's sideways. a monster. It's a monster. And he's like, oh, no, I got him sideways. Yeah, I got him. I mean, he ain't bad now. He ain't bad. Thought he was way bigger. I'll take it. Well, he just got him hooked weird. <laughs> yeah, he ain't bad at all. Uh -huh. He was right on the bank, too. Nothing to sneeze at. Yeah. Man, man, that's a good one. Yeah. Get him in. Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> hey, we're winning our own personal tournament, huh? <laughs> ah, there we Look go. at that one. Good deal. Oh, man. Yeah. Look at that piggy. Yeah, we're gonna upgrade on that one, guys. Uh -oh. If he's in a tournament, we'd upgrade. We're gonna have to stride him out right there. So we're pre-fishing for your tournament tomorrow, right? Yeah, we are. We're just checking out, see what we can do. But I think we found a pattern. So good well, stuff. Everybody, I hope you've enjoyed this episode of the Chew on This Saltwater Fishing Show. Captain John has put on a clinic, and uh, I tell you what, I'm happy. I'm just able to enjoy and get a little piece of action as well. Anyways, thank you very much for tuning in to Chew on This. All right, everybody, I'm still playing with this cool stool. That's not the name of it, it's a folding stool, but cool stool sounds pretty cool, so I kind of keep calling that. But it's from Nightcat, it's pretty awesome. I hope one of you win. I know one of you are gonna win, and, and to the lucky winner, good for you. <laughs> All right, well, we fish bass fishing with topwater lures two days after a cold front. It was bright blue skies. I thought it was gonna be tough fishing. You know what, Captain John, he had put us on the fish pretty quick. He caught a bunch that day. I even got in on the action, and not only did I get in on the action, we actually hooked some really big ones. Some of them jumped off, but all of them were really quality fish. It was really a good day. We had a great time. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, we were using a chug bug in that show, so uh, if you want to know what 
Captain John's favorite, favorite, favorite bass fishing top water is. It is a chub bug. He actually replaced the hooks with the, uh, I think the trocar hooks from Eagle Claw. So we had tight hooks, a great bait, and I feel like we did a pretty cool show. Hope you enjoyed it. Make sure, like, comment, share, all the awesome things. And remember, before you cast that bait out there to that big fish, you tell them, chew on this. Godspeed. I'll see you next episode. While I'm here playing with my accordion, I couldn't remember that name earlier for that musical instrument, but I'm playing with my accordion. And then whenever I get through playing with it, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to sit on it. But wait a second, I'm already sitting on it. Anyways, thank you guys very much for watching. We appreciate it.